Hey everyone, and welcome back to another great eShop Deals video. So if you're new to the series, this is a weekly series where every week we look at the best deals on the Nintendo Switch eShop, in my opinion. And basically this week, even more than usual, it's also important to note that last week's video is still very relevant. Almost every game from last week's video is actually still on sale this week. So as usual, I'll be doing a shout out to all the games that were featured in last week's video but I won't go into details like the new games for this week. So I'll be leaving a link up above. Once we're done, you can always check out that video if any of the games I give a shout out to seem of interest to you and you want a few more details before deciding to pick it up. Now, as usual, as we go through the video, if you do end up liking the video, please hit that like button and consider subscribing to the channel if you aren't already. But actually, to get started on the list, we're going to start with a couple of those shout outs from last week's list. Both Panzer Dragoon, which is a great on-the-rail shooter, it's a remake of a classic Sega game, amazing pickup, is still on sale for only $6.24. Also, Le Grand Legacy, which is a great JRPG, right now at only $1.99 is actually an incredible value for the package you're getting. But as I said, if you want more details, check out last week's video. Now let's get started with a new game for this week, and that would be ATV Drift and Tricks. Look, normally this would be a game that I would never recommend at full price. However, right now, because it's 94% off for only $1.99, I gave it a shot. And you know what? If you like arcade style off-road racing, it's a pretty decent experience for only $2. So, and since we don't get a lot of these games on the Switch, well, you know what? It was actually pretty fun to play with my kids this week. So honestly, I didn't think I'd like this game, but only at $1.99, it's a definite game that I can recommend to pick up for a really cheap arcade style racing game. Now the next game on our list is sort of the same type of deal again. I gave Moto Rush GT a shot this week because it's only $1.99 because it's 86% off. And you know what? It's actually a pretty fun experience of a motorcycle racer. And this is a type of game that is even more rare on the Switch. We really don't have many games like this at all. And for only $2, if you're into arcade racers once again, this is another experience that it's a great time to pick up. I mean, for only $2, it's a great, great value. And the quality of the gameplay actually surprised me quite a bit. So this is another game that surprised me this week. And... I would say is a definite pickup for anyone who's a fan of arcade racers. Now from those two games, we jump to what's probably one of the best overall games this week on the list, which is Dead Cells, which is back on sale at 50% off for only $12.49. Now this is a roguelite 2D action platformer. It is a very difficult game. However, it is also very, very rewarding. And once you get into it, it is extremely addictive. But it is overall, I think, one of the best roguelite type games on the Switch, bar maybe Hades. So if you like this kind of gameplay and you haven't tried it yet, definitely give Dead Cells a shot. You will not regret it. And just before moving on, there is also a bundle on sale this week. So if you think you're going to like this game and you want to take the huge plunge right away, you can actually pick up the bundle with all the DLC included because the latest DLC actually just dropped this week. It's called the Fatal Seed Bundle because that is also 33% off. The overall percentage is lower, but nonetheless, to get all the DLC right away included for the game, overall, it'll be cheaper if you pick it up as a bundle. Next is another quick shout out from a game from last week's list, which is Resident Evil Revelations 2, which is still 60% off at $7.99, a great pickup for a Resident Evil game. And following that, also a shout out because Resident Evil Revelations Part 1 is also on sale, still 60% off at $7.99. It's a great value once again, these are ports of the 3DS games, overall some of my favorite Resident Evil ports. And while we're on it, we still have another shout out. There's going to be a lot this week because like I said, almost all of last week's list is still on sale. We have Goblin Sword that is still on sale at only $1.99, which is a really simple yet satisfying 2D platformer. Now, next, we have another new game for this week, which will be Northgard. Now, this is actually an RTS style game. You know, basically, I would say it feels a lot more like a Command and Conquer than a Warcraft 3. But basically, you're controlling a barbarian tribe, a Viking tribe, 
And honestly, I was sleeping on this game. I just discovered this game this week as well because it fell on sale for 60% off and dropped to $13.99. And I really wish I would have discovered this game earlier because it is a ton of fun if you like RTS style games. Now, next on the list, we actually have the Bioshock collection that is back on sale for 50% off for only $24.99. And this, you're getting all three Bioshock games. You're getting Bioshock, Bioshock 2, and Bioshock Infinite. So this is honestly a great collection value-wise. It is a little more costly at $24.99, but you're getting all three games right away. And these are all three really great, you know, FPS slash basically horror games. I would say the first and second feel like slash horror games. Infinite goes more towards the action FPS game style. But overall, these are some great games that you're getting at a really cheap price. And the ports for the Switch are really well done as well. Now, while we're on the topic of collections that are back on sale, the XCOM 2 collection is also back on sale for 60% off at only $19.99. Basically this, you're getting the XCOM 2 game and you're getting the expansion as well. And honestly, I love this collection. This is a strategy shooter that basically you're controlling a Earth uh, faction that is trying to take the Earth back that's been overrun by aliens. And it's also a great, great strategy based game. Honestly, I love this game to death at $19.99. The Switch port is maybe not graphically the best version of the game, but it is very playable and having access to it in a portable format means that it's way easier to pour hours and hours into this game and to play missions on the go. Now, another shout out from last week's list, Fury Unleashed is still 50% off at $9.99. This is a, a great, great shooter game. Uh, basically, like I said, if you want more information, check out last week's video. Now, next on the list, we also have another costly game. However, I'm promising you guys right after this, we're getting into a bunch of really, really cheap games. And that is the wonderful 101 Remastered. Now, basically, this is a 3D action game. Really, really awesome in its style. It is a port of a Wii U game. And on top of it, there is a playable demo for it. Right now, it is 32% off at $27.19. This just came out at the end of 2020, so it's normal that it's still not like 60% off. However, at the same time, it is an amazing experience. And honestly, you uh, this is one that you really should try. At least try out the demo and see if you want to drop the money on it after that. Now, a shout out to last week's list again. Monster Boy is still on sale for $19.99. An amazing 2D platformer. One of my all-time favorites on the Switch. Like I said, check out last week's video. It's really worth it. Monster Boy is a great pickup. So another quick shout out, Blossom Tales is still 50% off at $7.49. A great Zelda, a top-down Zelda type game. Also another shout out from last week, Robonauts is still 50% off at only $1.99. Has a playable demo. Check it out. So talking about those budget games, a great new one for this week is the Bleed Complete Bundle. Basically, you're getting Bleed 1 and Bleed 2, which are some really, really solid action platformers. These are some great 2D platformers with a great cartoony style. It is a shooter-based type gameplay, uh, sort of a mix between platforming and bullet hell, but it is really, really great. And at 85% off for only $4.19 for both games, this is a great value package for this week. Another shout out from last week again, Odalis is still on sale, a great 2D Castlevania type a platformer, uh, check it out once again. Now another great amazing 2D action platformer is Tanuki Justice. This game took me by surprise, I really wasn't expecting this game to be good, but it is actually really really good. I love this game to death, it's only 25% off at $11.24. But trust me, the experience is worth it. This is not, however, an easy game, so be ready to a certain difficulty level. But trust me, if you like classic 2D experiences, Tanuki Justice brings you back to the great days of 8-bit NES gameplay. It, it feels amazing. Another shout out to a great 2D platformer that's still on sale this week. Oniken is still on sale for $2.99, 70% off. 
a great old, old school 2D platformer. Now the next game that's on sale is actually another one of the games that I love it when it falls on sale, and that is QEO Blaster. It's 80% off for only $1.99. This is basically a side-scrolling shooter, and it's done in the Parodia style. Or maybe more commonly, what you would know nowadays is sort of like the flying levels of Cuphead. However, don't expect the same level of difficulty as Cuphead. I'm using that only as a graphical reference and the overall gameplay style, but it is a great game to pick up and a ton, ton of fun. And for only $2, this is one of the best value propositions for this week. Now, another great game that's on sale this week is Xenoraptor, which is a blend between a 2D and 3D twin stick shooter. Uh, it's a amazing game. Right now, it is 70% off at only $4.49. This is a vis This is a game with really some amazing visuals. And basically, if you like twin stick shooters and you don't know what to play right now, Give this one a try. It's not a very long game, but it is definitely worth it when it's on sale like this at only $4.49. Now, the next game is another game that I love to suggest when it's on sale because at its full price, I don't necessarily recommend it. But when it's like this at 80% off for only $8.59, Grip is an awesome game to experience. Basically, it's an arcade style racer where the gimmick is that you can actually ride up the side of walls, even on the ceiling. It's actually quite, quite fun, although the game never goes too, too deep. However, and at full price when it's $42, I would say, you know, it's not worth it. But at $8.59 for the game and all the DLC included, because this is the digital deluxe pack, this is a definite game to give a try at this price. Now we're getting pretty close to the end of the list, but we do still have a couple left. The next game I want to look at is Miles and Kilo. This is a game that I actually overlooked for a long, long time just because the visuals seemed more like a kid game. But honestly, it is a pretty solid 2D platformer. And at 75% off for only $1.99, it is actually really, really worth it. And there's even a, once again, a downloadable demo. So if you want to try this game out first, give it a try. But if you like classic 2D platformers in the Mario style, Miles and Kilo is a really, really solid offering at only $2. Now, another shout out from last week's list, Val Ferris is still on sale for only $11.24, 55% off, a great 2D platform shooter. At last week, it was in a bundle. The bundle deal is over, but the game separately itself is still on sale. Not quite as good as last week, but I still do want to mention it because it is a great pickup. Now, the same thing is for the last game. Slain is still on sale this week, but last week it was in a different bundle. This week it's been shifted over to what's called the Horror Bundle Volume 1. And even though you can actually buy Slain on sale on its own, on its own it's it's costing you $5, like $4.99. And basically if you buy it in this bundle, it's actually cheaper and you get two other games with it. So for 85% off at $4.56, if you want the game Slain, which is my suggestion in this bundle, Pick, it, pick up the Horror Bundle Volume 1. You get two other games with it, which are, I would say, lackluster. But Slain on its own is way worth the $5. It's a great 2D action platformer. And I'm taking the time to go over this bundle because when this bundle goes on sale, it is really, really worth it. So that's pretty much it for this week's list. Now, even more than usual, this week has a lot of returning games from last week. So it's really, really a good idea to go watch that video. Like I said, I linked it up above. If you want to take a few minutes, check it out, and you can really make sure that you're taking the best deals overall on the eShop right now. At the same time, as usual, I invite everyone to leave comments, questions down below, any game suggestions that I might have missed, also please in the comments down below. And as usual, as I said at the beginning of the video, please don't forget to hit that like button to help the video out. Also at the same time, consider subscribing to the channel if you aren't already, and don't forget to hit the notification bell so you know when all my videos come out. And as usual, I hope I'll see you in my next video.